Damien Dunlap. You can follow me on Instagram, Send Be Fat, and Swole OG. Um, so I'm watching um, RX. He have Lee Priest, very entertaining guy. Um, was um, anyway, we ain't that. I think he a few years older than me, and um, they was talking about uh, phones in the gym. So this was this was always bothering me, even just like little things, you know, us older cats, you know, um, can't adapt or get upset about change. So let me give you. He says, it's, you know, I can understand his point, but we in a technology change, you know, when um, he was in his prime, I don't think cell phones would out like that. Matter of fact, you know, there, there wasn't. He, let me just say this. So <clears throat> he's, he's upset that people using their cell phones in the gym and he think they should bar him. I think that's what he was saying in a, in a nutshell. Okay. So let me give you my perspective. Lee pre start your own gym and see how far it going to go. If you banning cell phones and what's going to happen is you got the OG people like the, the hardcore bodybuilding going to go for it. But how do them, many of them hardcore bodybuilders, going to support your gym financially they might go there but usually them hardcore people uh, pros or whatever they want to go to a gym where they don't have to pay that much or they get in free a lot of gyms let them in free okay so <clears throat> my thing is at his age like right now i have my own equipment I actually i just only i i have i used to have five membership now i have three memberships um, if I, if I'm concerned about somebody on their phone, like I used to go to LA, uh, excuse me, 24 hour fitness three in the morning. Cause mainly because I wanted to get on the squats and I, it's only, they only had two squat racks in there and, uh, people be rushing over there. So I'll go that time in the morning. I don't care who's on their phone. I don't care if people socializing. If I find out around that time, it's consistently happening. I go at a different time. This is a commercial gym. So guess what? I always had my, I think since I was eight, I always had a weight set. Uh, my grandfather bought me my first weight set when I was eight. My mother bought me, I was plastic set. And then my mother bought me uh, my first iron set. I think it was, you seen I was a little serious. Um, I think about 11. I think about 11 years I had my first iron set, which I had those weights. Woo, for 30 some years and uh when i moved one time i told a guy he could have some scrap metal he decides when i left and sell him took my weights i was so pissed off i wish i could find that dude right now so anyway so then he said like oh you know i know people use um use it for programming and etc yeah that's true you know and he said well i remember everything blah 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 everybody can't remember everything dude you know you working out real hard you know, you can take your time. And he supposed to rest. I mean, this is the thing people bother me. E even now, you know, I just laugh it off. I don't know trip. I ain't getting upset over that. <clears throat> this is what I do. Especially when you use a gym I like a lot. a lot. Dave Fisher Gym. On one day, I think it's Thursday, they play country music. I can't work out to nobody playing no country music. I don't care what the hell you say. I, I grew up in the gym, we play. I want to even uh, uh, the white rock songs. I can work out too because that's what we the rock the uh, uh, that and um, rap music. Run DMC. It's like that. Uh, hard times. Double Dutch. I mean, going farther back. That's how long I've been working out. Um, we want to rock you. Stuff like that. You know. Now, I can't work out no country movie. If you can work out the country movie, it's cool. So what I do, I make sure if I go in that gym on Thursday, which I try to avoid, I have my music, right? That particular gym have a some where you can put your phone in and take this. I did it. It's on my Instagram, you know. Now, 
you know, somebody sitting on the bench for 30, 40 minutes, then you can, I, you should have a right to say something. I agree with that. But just like, I remember one time, a couple times, I'm trying to find some music. I'm, probably, I'm trying to <laughs> go at it hard. So there, there's what I think is a was some kind of proof that music pump you up, certain music pump you up. So I'm trying to find something to pump me up, which I've been doing for over 40 years, you know, listening to, them, to music. So why I'm going to change. So, um, so you just do what you want to do. Like I said, also people, like if, if I had running a business, a gym, <clears throat> I want the people to take all the pictures they can take. All the pictures. Put it on Instagram, Facebook, whatever, Snap, Twitter. People say, oh, this dude working here, they, that lady working in here, boom, boom, boom. Hopefully that they would generate income for me. This is the day and day we in now. We ain't, in, we ain't in where, you know, ain't no air conditioning and, and everybody listening to the same music. You know, that's why, you know, if you have, if you serious, you know what time to go to the gym. You know, okay, I'm going to go early in the morning. I'm going to go um, late at night and get my work in, you know, on work, or my ask the individual, you know, let me know when you're done. Usually most of the time you say, when you let me know I'm done, like, you know, bam. You know, most of the time I act, tell people that they come get me and vice versa. Okay, I'm done. You know, that's it. You know, people, 90% of the people in gym going is, is you know, cool and they're going to let you know. You know, so I'm just saying, so, um, and, it, and it's like, oh, you know, I, some people excel in certain things and some people, like certain, certain people, okay, I'm a good bodybuilder, I'm a good rapper, I'm a good entertainer, but they're not good business people. It's rare you have good combination of like two or three things. And, um, that's why he probably, why, um. You know. Anyway, let me just shut up on that. Have a wonderful day in your neighborhood. It's just my little talking shit, my little rant. You know, you can do what you, you do what you want to do. Uh, the day I'm I'm not joining no gym, but I can't use my phone. So you, you know, there's too many gyms gonna let me use my phone. And then in between my sets, I'm gonna f with my phone. Or if if I if they don't let me do that, I just go. Cancel my membership and go to another gym. Worst case scenario, I, I go get me some more weights and work out in my garage. They get my money. And guess what? And then I'm going to Snapchat and some Twitter and Instagram and Facebook myself. Have a wonderful day.